So what is Etsy? Is it just dropshipping except you use Etsy instead of Shopify? How does that make you more money? Dropshipping on Etsy is like dropshipping on eBay more than it is like dropshipping on Shopify. Shopify, you've got to build the store, you've got to build the brand, well, build the brand. You've got to build the store, you've got to build the brand, you've got to build the like Facebook advertising or digital traffic. Like you've got to build some sort of traffic source, right? So you've got to build the website and you've got to build the traffic source. You've got to figure out and master both of those crafts, essentially. Where it, when it comes to Etsy, you've just got to figure out like, you don't have to build the website. You have to list the products, figure out search engine optimization, which is not drastically, drastically hard. And the actual figuring out, like there's no creatives, there's no video creatives, there's no photo creatives, there's no UGC content, there's none of this bullshit that you have to deal with Facebook. Like I'm, t I'm testing a bunch of new products now with Facebook dropshipping, uh, Facebook dropshipping, Facebook advertising for one of my Shopify sites. And it's just so annoying. Like you've just got to do all these little details, like, like a bunch of annoying things, right? So with Etsy, you don't have all these problems. So it's a lot easier for a beginner to master Etsy than a beginner to master Shopify dropshipping. Like it just is. And then when it comes to like, can you make more money? Like how does this make you more money, right? Um, it's kind of comes down to consistency and just pure ease, right? Like if it takes you a month to figure out and how to become profitable on Etsy and you only spend $300, or it takes you three months and $2,000 to figure out on Shopify, like Etsy's better, if that makes sense. Like it just costs you less money to really get started and it's way more consistent once you get started. So one thing I will say is it's gonna be harder. You're not gonna create a brand on Etsy. Like it's just impossible. You're not gonna create the next Gymshark on Etsy. It's just not possible. You've got to sell products that you don't give a fuck about. Like a lot of people be like, uh, message me and they're like, oh, can I sell fitness products? Like I love the gym and I wanna sell fitness products on Etsy. I'm like, bro, no, that's not how you should go about things, right? You're not gonna create you're not gonna be able to sell something on Etsy that you necessarily have an emotional connection with, and you're not gonna be able to create a brand around it. That's one negative of it. And then obviously another negative is that you're at the whim of the marketplace to a certain degree, but you're still at the whim of the marketplace when you're doing Shopify dropshipping because Shopify can ban you and like Facebook or whoever can ban you as well. But that's kind of the best description that I can quickly give of that topic.